This video will demonstrate the profile section of the Protein Mobile app and describe the different screens and input fields required to set up a new user profile. The first section is Anthropometry, where the user provides anthropometric information, namely their gender, date of birth, height, weight, and physical activity level. After completing this section, the user clicks the Save button and waits for a confirmation before proceeding. For the physiological section, the user is required to input their resting heart rate. They can then save their changes and continue. For diet, the user provides a range of dietary information related to them. Food allergies, any potential food intolerances, specific food choices or the user's preferred diet, any cardiovascular conditions, any specific medical conditions, and finally their diet and or activity goals. The user can return to the diet section once their profile is completed, where their intake of CHO, iron, protein, vegetables, their caloric intake, as well as their sugar and salt intake, will be displayed as numerical indicators. These values will be processed and categorised by the system after the creation of the user's nutritional and activity plans. After entering their diet information, the user saves their changes and waits for a confirmation. The physical activity section shows data obtained from connected mobile device sensors and displays to the user their daily step count and daily caloric energy expenditure. The user can then click on the tab below to proceed to the fitness level assessment. Here, information is provided related to the user's fitness level, i.e. their peak heart rate, which is shown as a numerical indicator, the number of hours the user sleeps per night, which is shown in the form of text and numerical indicators, and whether they are a smoker or non-smoker, which is indicated by selecting none or yes using a radio button. After completing this final section of their profile, the user clicks save and is then taken to the protein application dashboard. From the dashboard, the user can navigate back to the profile section by clicking on the profile logo in the top center where they are able to view the completion percentage of each section of their user profile.